Hey guys, how you doing? This is Ocean's 11 2001 official trailer. And this is this is the remake that came out 41 years after the 1960 version. So let's get into it. Vegas. Fantastic. The heist is impossible. Casino security cannot be beaten. You're out of your minds. Exactly. You are up to something, Danny. What? You're pulling a job, aren't you? You're a thief and a liar. I only lied about being a thief. You're going to need a crew as nuts as you are. What do you got in mind? Smash and grab job, huh? Slightly more complicated than that. Say we get down the elevator, we can't move. And past the guards with the guns. And into the vault we can't open. We're just supposed to walk out of there with a hundred and fifty billion dollars in cash. Yeah. Oh. But these guys, that is the sexiest thing I have ever seen, are just crazy enough. You need at least a dozen guys doing a combination of cons. Do you want to stand any of this? I'll explain later. To pull off the con. Someone call for a doctor. Of the century. We're set. We're set. We're set. Do it already. Well, check it out. George Clooney, Matt Damon, Andy Garcia, Brad Pitt, and Julia Roberts. Why do this? Why not do it? From the Academy Award winning director of Traffic and Aaron Brockovich. Because the house takes you. Unless when that perfect hand comes along, you bet big, and then you take the house. Been practicing this speech a little bit. Did I rush it? Felt like I rushed it. I liked it. Ocean's Eleven. You're either in or you're out. I'm staying in. So this film is excellent. It's definitely a recommendation to anyone who have not seen this film. Please go and watch it, please. Uh, what I have to say is that the three cas in this one in this version of uh, Ocean's Eleven, they robbed basically three casinos. Well, the money from all three casinos. That is, in the original, I forgot what I failed to mention in the in the the previous video before this was that it was five casinos. So yeah, they just dropped two off, but. I have no complaints about this movie. Um, I'm about I'm, I'm about to do the Ocean's Eight reaction next, so stay tuned for that. That will be coming up in another few more minutes as well. Um, this is the only movie, in my opinion, that stands out for George Clooney. Uh, that I actually like with George Clooney and Brad Pitt and the, um, Bernie Mac, Bernie Mac, Julia Roberts, and uh, Andy Garcia. I really enjoy their. Um, their performance in this film as well. Um, couldn't find anything wrong with, except for the sequels. The sequels, I think they should have just stopped. This they should have just stopped with Ocean Eleven, and that was it. That was cool that they gave us a sequel, Ocean's Twelve and Ocean's Thirteen. But compared to both, both um Ocean's Twelve and Ocean's Thirteen, I liked Ocean's Thirteen a lot more better than Ocean's Twelve because it was a little bit too slow for me in Ocean's Twelve, and I don't feel like they used a lot of common sense within the film. A few, yeah, yeah. Like, pay attention to this and that. You will spot a lot of flaws uh, of Ocean Twelve and Ocean Thirteen, but Ocean Thirteen did a much more better job. That's what I'm trying to say. Okay, guys, my name is Victor Walters, and I'll see you guys in the next few more minutes or so. Peace.